If you could get one more season of a TV show that no longer airs, which would it be? We are owed a community movie. Seventh season with all the original cast would also suffice. Hoping the show being on Netflix now will give it the push it needs to get a film made. It seems to be doing really well on there. So many gas leaks. I hope they can ever do it justice. That last season was just not funny. It was fine, but it really lost some magic. The OA. Flash forward. I don't care what anyone says. That ST was getting interesting. Avatar The Last Airbender. It was an absolute masterpiece. It's a different medium. So not quite the same. But the comics. The promise. Comma. The search. Comma. Etc. Do continue the story of Team Avatar. They really are worth a look if you love the show. They're a spin-off. You probably know about The Legend of Korra. Yeah I've seen it before and I liked it. But it's just not the same. I'd like to see more of Team Avatar as adults. Carnival. Game of Thrones. The eighth season felt too rushed for me. Firefly. Take my love. Take my land. Take me where I cannot stand. You can't take the sky from me. Firefly. One full season? I got to see it far too late and the few episodes on the DVD were such a revelation. Funny. Smart. Great atmosphere to the show. Incredible characters. Man. A full season. Two broke girls. I want to see what things will be like after Max and Randy get married. How will Max's life change now that she's married? And to a wealthy man at that. Randy is a wealthy lawyer? How will Caroline's life continue? Hannibal. Anyone? As much as I'd love another season one feel like the ending was so poetically perfect that it'd be doing it an injustice by continuing. Absolutely. lutely The Muppets. 2015-2016. TVPG. Available on Disney+. Plus. Constantine. 2014-2015. TV14. Available on DC Universe and CW Seed. I know I might be the only one. But. Terra Nova. With you there. Really enjoyed the premise. I worked as an extra on this and the place we went to was so pretty. I was so excited to finally watch it and when I did I was just like. Where is the rest? Why no more? I was going to say Terra Nova. 2. So many introduced plots points that never resolved. Colon. I'll be alone in this but. Better off Ted. Not completely alone in that. I don't know why that show didn't do better. It was hilarious. It got caught up in the writer's strike. That show was so good and so short. And apparently so forgettable. I haven't thought about it in years. Thanks for the reminder. Stargate Universe or the OA. White Collar. I might be the only one. I loved White Collar. I feel satisfied with the ending but they could have done one season or a mini season of what he did in Paris. Freaks and Geeks. Gravity Falls. Gravity Falls had such a fantastic ending that I'm really satisfied with what we have. Parks and Recreation. I need so much M.O.R.E. Last Man on Earth. Yeah same. The cliffhanger when it got cancelled was just too F.G. big. I hardly knew her. Boom. Futurama. I miss it so much heart suit. I'd love another season. But at least the last season gave it a good ending. Considering what The Simpsons has turned into. I think I'm okay with Futurama being over. It had a great first run. And a solid second run. Good news everyone. Eastbound and down. Kenny fucking powers. Angel or Torchwood. Either the devil is a part-timer. Or Hunter x Hunter. I think they are marking another season to Hunter x Hunter. No game no life. It's a travesty that we do not have the whole story in anime form while there is so much trash out there. Log Horizon deserved better too. It was just announced earlier this year that Log Horizon is getting a season 3. Upvote for including Log Horizon.
or as I call it the better sow. Santa Clarita diet. Explain Mr. Ball legs. Explain him. Santa Clarita diet. This cartoon I watched growing up called My Life as a Teenage Robot. Was literally my favorite show as a kid. Only had three seasons. No actual ending. I really kinda just want an ending. I forgot about that show. I loved it as a kid. Be the change you want to see in the world. Do it as a webcomic using stills from the first three seasons. I need your help figuring out if I am thinking of the right TV show. A long time ago, I watched an episode of a cartoon where people were turned into zombies by saying some special phrase that was detected by some hypersensitive machine. As I recall, it was something along the lines of, yes, turns you into a zombie. But quickly saying, yes, yes, prevents it. In the end, I think they somehow recalibrated the machine to make zombie grunt noises turn you back to normal. I feel like this was an episode of my life as a teenage robot. But I am not sure and I cannot find any reference to an episode like this online. Are you able to verify if you remember any episode like that? Merlin. The ending to Merlin made me so angry. You spend the entire show building up destiny and the time when Merlin tells Arthur. Then none of that really happens and the show ends literally right after he finds out. Avatar The Last Airbender. How I Met Your Mother. Pushing daisies. Came here for this. Rushing the last episode to try to tie everything up was just depressing. The IT crowd. Yes. Please. The in-betweeners. But I'd want it well into the future when they're all in their late 30s or something. My name is Earl. Definitely. A complete redo of the GOT final season. Truly amazing that it was so horrendous it retroactively spoiled the rest of the series for me. I don't think I could rewatch it knowing how disappointing the entire final season was. I deleted it all. And I never delete anything. I still have Dexter FFS. TBF the last season of Dexter doesn't do as much retroactive damage. The first four seasons still stand on their own. Got was all building towards the end and it ruins all the foreshadowing. DuckTales. Santa Clarita Diet. FK Netflix and their renewal algorithm. Such a good show. The cliffhanger is killing me. Phineas and Ferb are drawn together. Drawn together would be amazing right now. I love Phineas and Ferb. But I think the creators did all they could with it by the end of it. The backdoor pilot didn't catch on and the in-universe reboot spiritual successor thing, Milo Murphy's Law couldn't really live up to the show before it. I love both shows for the most part. But I don't think the creators had much more they could do with it. The final season already felt like they knew that they were wrapping up well before the finale. Gilmore Girls Lie to me or don't trust the bee in apartment 23. Both please. I loved those shows. Dead Like Me. Loved that show. Stargate Universe. So many things left unfinished because of how it was cancelled. Yeah I mean it was a bit rough midway through the show but it started to get really interesting again towards the end. I wish they would have been given the time to find their groove. I mean Star Trek TNG wasn't exactly the height of television for the first season or two either. Heard they made a comic to continue the story. That killed me. The main characters had just gelled and it felt like they were gaining story and character traction. And then it ended. Limitless. Might not have been too popular but I thoroughly enjoyed it. Is that the one where the guy becomes limitless? Wish they would continue Hunter x Hunter. Death Note. They released a spin-off manga. Oh heck really? Is it still called Death Note? Actually it's a one-shot just search Death Note one-shot. Daredevil. Y e e e e e s s s s s s s s some monumentally ST shows being touted here. It's got to be The Sopranos. Lucifer. Zoo. Firefly. 
can I get one less season of a show instead? Because if so, definitely scrubs. FK that final season to HL. What do you mean? All eight seasons of scrubs were great and there were no more episodes after my finale. I believe the big issue with season 9 is the title. As season 9 of scrubs. It was CP. But as season 1 of the spin-off scrubs. Med school. It was pretty good. Teen Titans. They deserve so much more than Teen Titans Go. Man. Young Justice came back and that made me happy. But Teen Titans was beautiful. Yes. I keep hoping. Even though I understand the extremely low likelihood of this. That they'll do a few extra episodes to round things out. Since there's obviously still interest in Teen Titans. Firefly. Arrested Development. But circa 2006. The Netflix shows just aren't the same. Arrested Development was not appreciated for the landmark comedy it is when it first aired. We watched it to help us get through those final Bush years. I love that it has had a resurgence in popularity. Home Movies. Holy ST you just changed the course of my night. Found full episodes on YouTube too. Bless you. Can I ensure that the original creators don't nosedive the quality? If so. Full Metal Alchemist. Brotherhood. Dot. It really doesn't need a sequel. But I would love to spend more time in that world as long as it doesn't ruin much. Woody Woodpecker. Pink Panther. Or Inspector Gadget. They were my childhood. My uncle was one the original animators for Hanna-Barbera. He did Pink Panther and. The Smurfs. He used to send us NSFW drawings of Pink Panther with Smurfs. The Mick. Pushing Daisies. Bojack Horseman. But it ended so perfectly. I don't know I didn't really feel like I got a lot of closure at the end. I don't think I'd want another season because the ending felt right but it just wasn't very satisfying. I don't necessarily think it was supposed to be super satisfying. It was the most Bojack Horseman ending that it could have been. Every main character spent a year without Bojack in their lives and they were much better off for it. And Bojack accepted that which would eventually make his life better in the long run. I don't think they could have finished it any better. Adventure Time Jericho Avatar The Last Airbender So they could adapt the comics into the series. King of the Hill. I've heard rumors about its return. But I'm pretty doubtful. The Og Teen Titans. Sounds odd but Avatar The Last Airbender. The show actually had one more season to go however it was cancelled and the movie happened instead. The creator said his goal for the last season was to learn where Zuko's mother was. Have Aang struggle with the evil energy he absorbed from Ozai and give Azula a redemption arc. However I'm glad the show ended in a way that it felt completed. Y'all beat me to it. I came to say Firefly 2. Stargate Universe. Warehouse 13 I loved that show. High School of the Dead. Twin Peaks. Pushing Daisies. Terminator. The Sarah Connor Chronicles. Peep Show. The Middle. Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. The Joy of Painting. Who doesn't like Bob Ross's show? Show from way back when called Pirates of Dark Water. Never finished the show and they left me hanging something fierce. Firefly. Just one more season though. Any more would be too far and get stale. Santa Clarita Diet. Slash. Avatar The Last Airbender. The Oa. In the Flesh. Incredible show that got cancelled on a cliffhanger. Even one more season in my heart wouldn't hurt so bad. Clone High. Dirk Gently's Holistic Detective Agency. Such creative and unique show it's a shame it only got two seasons. Better Off Ted. Gravity Falls. Seinfeld. That show could be endless. Firefly. Psych. I miss that show. 
at least it's getting another movie. Or, Invader Zim. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe to the channel for more videos.